Hi, I'm Dr. Gloria Richard Davis. I'm a fertility specialist. I also specialize in perimenopause, menopausal care, along with other women health specialty at UMS. Every woman, if she lives long enough, will go through menopause. That transition from perimenopause, if you look at what happens in your 20s, your cycles are typically very regular. In your 30s, you might have some irregularity. By 40, it's more likely you have some irregular periods. That usually is accompanied by some of the very same symptoms that your mom complains of in menopause. Hot flushes, night sweats, inability to sleep at night, um, and vaginal dryness. So it might affect your intimacy with your partner. If you think about and I usually say to women, what happens if you don't get a full night's rest? What do you think you're gonna feel like the next day? So unless you address those issues, then the rest of your life will be affected by the fact that you're not getting restful sleep. Once you go through menopause, there are a number of health issues that women need to be concerned with. One is the number one uh, killer in women is heart disease. And what we do know is postmenopause, that increased risk exists for women. So making sure that you look at your lipids and your nutritional component. The other thing is we lose bone. We lose bone at a rate of almost 5% per year. And so there needs to be screening for women um, to make sure that they're not developing osteopenia, which means thinning of their bones, or osteoporosis, which is really at the extent that they've lost pretty significant amount of bone, where there are medical treatments to prevent or to treat those entities. Many women who are going through menopause feel like they have to just suffer through it. Their mom got through it, they'll get through it, or they're talking to their friends and they're not coming in and talking to their physician. There are multiple options in terms of treatment. It doesn't have to be hormonal treatment in order to treat your symptoms and get you back to feeling good, feeling good about yourself.